Good afternoon, everyone. This is Bremster, and today I'm coming to you with Oh Rats um, by Ratfinks. This is apparently Ratfinks's first puzzle, um, and I'm really cool that this was recommended. Um, so, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing this. What's going on? Life is going on around me, and um, I've done some streams recently, one of which, um, because of an OBS technical issue, I got um, copyright struck because I listen to music while I'm solving, and that got sent to the stream, and Google has this really cool feature now where you can remove music without removing the, um, o the voice, which was really cool, so I was able to remove those strikes, but, um, and those strikes were perfectly valid, I was listening to copyrighted music, and that was perfect perfectly valid. Um, but as soon as you edit a video in any way, shape or form, you lose the live chat feature. So my stream number five kind of uh, has lost its live chat, which is a bit a, a bit disappointing. Um, but um, I'm hoping to do some more streams. We'll see how that goes. Uh, timing is really hard. I am doing more D&D &D videos, um, which is kind of cool. And people are saying, if you're so busy, why are you doing this? I need some downtime. And D&D &D is what I'm doing to relax. Um, so um, while it may look like it's like, well, you're producing content, I'm doing that for my fun. I am, I'm not playing video games or anything at the moment. What I'm doing is when I get some downtime and I'm not getting a lot of it, I'm playing D&D &D and I'm doing it on camera. Um, and I'm sharing that because why not? Um, so yeah, that's what's going on on my channel at the moment. Um, all of those are in playlists that you can find in the playlist section of my channel. Um, and I'm releasing some of it live. And yeah, it's findable. Go look. Um, let's have a look at this puzzle. Oh, Rats by Ratfinks. Um, so there is an obvious rat in the grid. Um, so apart from that, normal Sudoku rules apply. So in every box, in every row, and in every column, the digits one to nine must be placed without repetition. We have thermos, um, and along thermos, digits must strictly increase from the bulb to the tip. This digit will be higher than this, this digit will be higher than this, digit. this digit will be higher than this. They cannot go down, they cannot stay the same. They must always go up. Um, and digits in bordered circles, which are these ones, not these ones, these are the bulbs of the thermos, these are the um, bordered circles, they must be odd. That's what we've got for this one. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Uh, I'm also going to, I've been told that the um, the check pencil marks feature, there's been some development. I don't know if it's on beta or on the live version yet, so that it doesn't work for constraints as much, but only for rows, columns, boxes. Um, Sven's been doing some work on that. Um, I don't know if it's live on this version yet, but uh, we're going to see how this goes. I've been told this isn't too hard, so I probably don't need the check pencil marks. I may turn it off partway through. I'm doing some testing and you're getting to see that. So this is one, three, and seven, and the two odd digits to the left are five and nine. And okay, that is a fairly obvious placement. Uh, I possibly would have seen that, but you know, I'll take the hint. These are two, four, six, and eight, but uh, I'll happily mark a quad most of the time, but that does feel a little over the top. Now this can't be a nine, so this is maximum eight, which does reduce this, eight, seven, six, five, four. So this is down to four four candidates, but that feels a bit weird. One only, no, one only, one of those has to be a one. So this is one, three, five or nine, and it can't be nine. So this is five, of course, because it has to be odd. So I'm getting the odd digit straight away. So the circles are done because it sees one, three, seven, and nine. So this is five. So maybe this is more restricted than I think. So this has a maximum of eight, seven, six, four, and three. And this can't be three. So this is one or this is one or two. Um, this is two, three, or four, four, five, or uh, four or six, because it has to be, it can't be three or five, and it has to be higher than two, and it can't be higher than six. So this is six or seven, because it can't be five, so, and it has to be higher, and this is seven or eight. So this is more restricted than, than it looks. Nine in this row is in one of those two. I, I have no idea if I'm looking at this the right way. But you know, it's fun. So one is in one of those two cells. Eight, uh, I'm not sure. Nine, nine is up, nine is in one of those two cells because I can't put it at here because this would be 10 and 11. Um, do I just want to pencil mark all of these? This is seeming a little over the top at this point. I feel I should be able to do more logic. So 
So seven is down here somewhere. So seven is up here. So seven is in one of those two. And five is here somewhere. Five, four, three, two. Yeah, that could all work. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Nine, eight. But these are looking next to each other. So there is going to be a restriction on these placed by each other. I'm probably just missing something incredibly obvious. So one in this box is in one of those. One in this box is in one of those. I, f I feel it's this row. Like three in this row is in one of those, but I can't go three, two, one, can I? No, that would be four. Nine, eight, seven, yeah, that could work. I mean, I, I know I'm not at my solving best right now um, with everything that's going on. There's probably something incredibly obvious. Let's pencil mark these long thermos. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, and four. So one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five, th three, four, five, six, four, five, six, seven, five, ooh. Of course they can't be five or six, seven or eight. So six, eight, and then seven, eight, nine. And they'll be the same here. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. So uh, four, but it's one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five, three, four, five, six. This one can't be three. Higher than four. So five, six, seven, six or eight, because it has to be higher than five. And then seven, eight, nine again. So this is six or eight. So I've got a six, eight pair here. So what? So five, six, seven, eight, nine. So these are all from one, two, three, four. That one can't be three, which I did notice as I was doing it. So I've got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, but that's not putting any real pressure on this. Nine, eight, seven, six, four, nine, eight, six, five, four. This has a maximum of three. Nine, eight, can't be seven, so six. This can't be five, so it's four. So this is only one, two, or three. I don't... I am really missing this. So the maximum of nine, maximum of eight, maximum of six, maximum of four. So two, three, four. So this, oops, two, three, four. So this is a one, two, three, four, five quintuple. So these are from six, seven, eight, nine, and I can't put nine in either of those. So this is six or seven, and it can't be seven. This is six. This is seven or eight. This is eight or nine. And these are seven, eight, nine. This is weird. That makes this four, which means this is not four. I still don't have to put two in here, do I? This is one, three. I'm trying to figure out how these line up. One, two, three, four. This could be six, eight. Seven, eight pair takes eight out of those and makes that six. So there's no six here. This is two and four. There's no two, four here. This is six, eight. So one, two, three, four, there's, yeah, one, two, three, four, seven in here. Seven is in here. This is eight. This is nine. There is no eight or nine there. This is seven. There's no seven or eight there. This is nine. This is not the nine, and this is the nine. There's no seven here. I, this feels, pencil marks here feels very weird, but, um, I said I would try it. Um, on this puzzle, it seems a bit weird, but it is just with eliminating pointing stuff. So maybe it's not too bad. So one of these is five. So one of these has to be six. Hang on. That can't be six anymore. So five, six here means this can't be six. But one of those has to be six because one of those has to be five. So that is six, which means this is now seven, eight, and nine. This is now six, five, four. This is not four or five. This is not four or three. There's no four here. 
Okay, where is five in this row? It's only there. Four is in one of those two. If four is there, I'm not sure. What are these two? One, two, three, four, five, six, two and eight. And I can't put eight there because of that one. So that's two, that's eight. These is one, two, three. So this is one or three only because of the two in here. And two comes out of there. Two comes out of there. Oh, because of that two, two comes out of there. So this is one or three. There's no two on this. Don't know that that does anything because there's a lot of freedom here still. These have got to have more play. This is where I thought I would start and I still haven't because I can, where do I put nine in this row now that I can't put nine there? Can't put it partway along a thermo. This is the nine. So eight is now in one of those two. One is absolutely in one of those two. Seven is in one of those three. Well, it's not there. Seven is there, that's eight. If seven is there, that's eight. Mm, yeah, not sure about that either. Huh. So one, three, and five go up here, I think. Four, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, these are one, three, and five. One, two, three, four, five, six, and eight. One, two, six, and eight. One. One is still possible in all of those. It's got to be down here. So this is lower than all three of those. One of these has to be at least two. But if it's two, that becomes three, and then four becomes freed. I'm not sure how this is working. And I'm sure that's just me being dumb. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can't go there, but it could go there. Eight. Can't go there. Can't. Hang on. Eight. This is an eight. Where does eight go in this row? It's not here. It's not here. It's not here. It's not here. This is the eight in the row. So now where does seven? Go? Oh, no, that doesn't change anything. But there, eight is now not here. And if I can't put eight here, where do I put eight in this row? I'm not putting it there because this would be eight and a half. I'm not putting it there or there because I need nine higher than it. This is the eight. Okay, which puts eight somewhere up here. So this becomes the eight. So now seven is in one of those two. What are, the, I'm just going to pencil mark this row. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, seven. Well, this is not seven. This is these are not one. This is not seven. This is also not three. This is not three. So three is not over here, which I kind of knew. So this and I can't put three here. Oh no, I could. Because three here would make this one and this two. And then this would be one. If this is four, eight is down, eight is in one of these two. So this has a maximum of seven. And it can't be six, but it's still got lots of options. I'm really, this was listed as an easy puzzle and I still believe it is. It's just Bremster is missing stuff. 
Like, I imagine there's a lot of people yelling at the screen going, how did you miss this thing? I missed this thing because I did. Um, one, two, three, four, seven. Four is up here somewhere. Four is in one of those two. Is it thermologic? Like, I don't need one of those to be anything. If this is three, this is one. If this is four, this is one or three. If this is four, this is three, one. If this is one, this is three, four. There's nothing. One, two, three, four, three would work. One, three here. I think could still work. I've got to force something somehow. Seven is in one of those two, which means this is not seven. That's it. Seven is in one of these two. So this is not seven. Where does seven go in this row? It goes here. I, don't, I think this is a one-star puzzle on Logic Masters Germany. Again, I'm not feeling that, but whatever. Um, this is a seven, which puts seven in one of the... Uh, in here and it's not here or here. So this is a seven. Okay. This can't be four anymore because there's nothing higher than it here. Now I've still got to put nine in one of those two. That's a nine by Sudoku, nine, 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 yeah, that's a nine. Okay, so nine in this box I've already got. Okay, cool. Can I actually chase the nines? Yes, I can. Nine, nine, that's a nine. Do more Sudoku, Bremster. That will help. Eight. Now, eight is not here or here. So eight is in one of those two, which actually, unfortunately, lines up with all of that. Seven, 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 seven. Nope. Seven, actually, I can place a seven. Seven is right there. Sixes. <sighs> Sixes in one of those two. Six down here. So these have a maximum. Right, here we go. I can't do six, seven, eight, or nine in those. So they've got a maximum of four and five. So that can't be four. If this was four, these would have to be from five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I can only use one of them. So that's not the four. Where does the four go in this row? That becomes the four, which means I can't put four in there. I can't put four there. So four is in one of those two. These are one, two, and three. This is a one, two pair. So there's no one, two here. This is a three, four. These are from two, four, and five. And that's not a four. Because I can't use three and I can't use six, seven, eight, nine. So these are from two, four, five. So in, if this is four, five, this could be a two. If this can't be four, five, this is a one. Got to put a one in one of those two. I'm sure I'm just being an idiot. These are still unresolved, which five is in one of the, ah, no, five. Five is not here, here, or here. This is a five. Can I chase fives? Now, five, five, five is down here. This is a five, which means this is not a five. This is, could still be four, five. Five is in one of those two, though. Five in this box. Five in this box is in one of those two. This is not a five. That's a one, three pair. This is a five. What are these? These are one, three, and seven. 
One, two, three, four, no. There's a six in one of those. This is a one, two, three, four triple. So that is a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. this is a six. So this is an eight, this is a six. This is not an eight, this is an eight. Now, these are from one, two, three, four. So this is one, two, and four. Uh, it's not four, ah, because of that. Four is absolutely in one of those two because of that four, which means this is a three. There's no three in those, which means this is one, two, four, this is three, this is two or four, and there's a one, two pair. That's four, that's two, that's four. There's no three here anymore, but that's okay. So one, two, four. Okay, this is one or two. So three in this column is up here. Have I forgotten thermos? Please tell me I've forgotten thermos. I don't think I've forgotten thermos. There's no eight here because of this. So this is the eight. Still got to put six in this box but it could still go in either of those, as far as I can tell. These are one, two, three, and six. This is the six, because of that six, six is not there. This is the six, this is not the six, this is the six. And these are from one, two, three, that's not three. This is from one, two, three, four. Hang on, this six is taking six out of there and making this six, okay. So this is one or two, giving me a one, two pair. This is five and four. The five looks up, meaning that's not five and this is. This is one, two or three. So this thermo is now done. This thermo is now done. Any value that goes in that is good. This thermo is done. This one could still have some results. This one could still have some results. Ah. Oh. I maybe just a worse, have gotten worse as a solver because people are rating puzzles like this as one star. And to me, one star puzzles are ones where you just go digit, 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 digit. And I'm not doing that. So these are one, two, three, four, and seven. So these are, this is one, two, seven. Okay. One, two, three, four. And this is one, three, four, and seven. Like I'm trying to see chaining, like if this is two, three, this is one, four, seven, and that's okay. If this is two, one, this is three, four, seven, and that's okay. This is two, one, two, one, three. Okay, is this a coloring puzzle? On ones and twos? Like this, if this was a one, this would be a two. So this would be a one, this would be a two. Whatever this is, this is the other one. This would be yellow. But that kind of stops. This would be blue. Is there anything that sees blue and yellow? Now, yellow would be in here, but that's not telling me much.
Like these are colored, but can I associate it to this? Like I know blue is in here, but again, I don't know which one. It could be either of them because this could be a three. What am I missing? If this is blue, this is yellow, I don't follow. If that's three, one, no, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. I do not think this is a one star deduction. If this is three, this becomes one. Three and one both see that cell, which becomes seven, and then one and seven both see this. This can't be a three, that's a four, which means that's not a four, that's not a four. Where does four go in this box? It goes there, which means this is not a four. This is a one, two pair, which makes this a three, this is not a three. This becomes a one, this becomes a two, this becomes a one, this becomes a two, three, two, one, two, one, four. Uh, there's no two there. This becomes seven and two. Uh, this is one, three and one. And yeah, I'm just chasing pencil marks, but um, you know, that's okay. The, you know, the two and the three mean this is the one. The one looks over making this three. The digit missing from here is seven. The one looks over making this two and this becomes one. And that is the correct solution. So there was a trick I could do here with the three one, meaning this had to be seven. And then I'd have the one seven looking at that cell, giving it no value. That was the trick. Don't call that one star. Two, maybe. But yeah, wow. Really cool though, as a first puzzle, that was really nice. It just had to find it. Some really nice thermo deductions in that one. That was very, very cool. As a first puzzle, I love it when setters come up with something cool as a first puzzle, particularly thematic like this, like the, the rat puzzle for rat finks. But that was really, really fun. And, you know, thermo deductions like that, very, very nice. And it wasn't long chains. I was just looking in the wrong place. Thank you, Ratfinks. Really appreciate the puzzle. Um, and I, I really hope you do more and uh, send them to me. Um, that would be great. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Um, hope you're enjoying the content as always. And as always, good luck with your solving.